Hello Pisces, welcome back to the channel, it's the Steam Tarot, and today we're going to do your love reading to see what's going on with your person. Um, Pisces, if you are new here, remember to like the video if the video does resonate with you, by liking the video here on YouTube, YouTube sees that you like it, and push the videos to into a bigger audience so the video can grow, so the channel can grow, okay? Pisces, so far you've been doing good with your video, so let's keep this going, alright? That's the only way I know how... Um, I know that you like these videos as well with all the field feedback and everything like that. So I'll keep them going. Okay. All right. Let's get into your energy Pisces and see what's going on with your person. You might hear my cats. So. All right. Let me push up my drawer a little bit. going on with Pisces and their person. What messages do you have for Pisces and their person, please? Thank you, angels. What messages do you have for Pisces and their person? So we have the death card in reverse, okay? So someone feels stuck in a situation here. So let's keep going here. I feel like something ended in this relationship and they feel stuck like they don't know if they want to move on from this or with anyone else I, this person does feel stuck like if anything this person just wants to um get back with someone or make things work with just that one person but they feel stuck here then we have the king of pentacles yeah i feel like this person looks like you, oh wow <laughs> This person looks at you as the king of pentacles, somebody very stable, somebody very nurturing, somebody very kind, someone that wants a commitment. They know what, you know, your worth is, you know? Um, let's see. The tower moment. Wow. This is crazy. Yeah, we have the tower moment here. So you walked away from this person. Stop talking to this person. Stop texting this person. Like the texts and calls got less and less until you guys decide to not talk to each other anymore. I do see a strong bond coming through with the two of cups here, the king of cups, and also the five of pentacles here, where somebody left somebody for somebody else, or it could be somebody left someone in debt. Um, somebody was very selfish in this relationship and took a lot. This person probably took money from you for some of you. Um, and left you with a lot of burden, okay? I see like you are struggling to put the pieces back together for some of you. You have probably had a bank account with this person. You probably had a life planned with this person. I feel like this person is your soulmate though. The soulmate connection always hurt the most. Um, you know, they do care about you, do love you. I feel like this person feels the same way about you, the way you feel about them. I feel like you're marrying each other at this present time. And this person wants to give you stability and wants to give you, you know, the commitment that you want. You know, this is what they want. A more stable connection with you with this two of cups here wants to get back together. I feel like you want the same thing, but this person puts you through a lot. Okay. Through a lot. You have the chariot here. You have the star here. Wow. And then you have the page of wands here. Wow, 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 wow. This person did something and then it ended. And then this person now wants to get back with you. I feel like the chariot is here. The star is also here. And then we have the page of wands, which tells me that this person has a lot of fear and anxiety with approaching you, but they're going to do it anyways. Okay, because they have a lot to say to you. And I feel like right now the star is telling me that it's the perfect timing for you guys to get back together and talk about this. You don't have to get back together as a couple, but I feel like the, the angels are guiding you back together with a star here in the upright. So, that, you know, this person needs to be very careful who ever hurt anyone here because the universe is involved with this. I feel like this connection is very important to the universe and that's why they're trying to put you guys together. But remember, everybody has free will to decide what they want to do. You cannot control anyone, okay? And this is what's going on. You guys are soulmates, you know? You guys feel the same way for each other but this person is going to put you through a lot and you as well going to put this person through a lot 
I feel like this person has a lot of baggage, nothing to do with you, okay? And they know that they do. And at least at this point with a the chariot, they're moving slowly towards you, but they know they're coming towards you, okay? All right. We have the Ten of Wands, the Ten of Swords, and then we have the Cup, uh, the Page of Cup, the Ace of Swords. Wow. Oh my God. So, you know, I feel like you tried to hold on to this relationship. You really wanted it to work. Um, you hold on to it. For some of you, we might had people thinking that this relationship was very um, beautiful. But on the, on the truth is, you know, you were struggling. You guys were struggling together to stay together. I feel like there's a lot of healing that's needed. And I feel like somebody made a choice for themselves where... Hey, I need time for me with this 10 of uh, swords here. I need time to heal. And that's not over for you. I feel like you are still healing, okay? And then we have the page of cups. So an apology is coming through here with this person because they realize they're wrong. So this person is definitely making the right decision. Wow. This is a beautiful reading. Look at this. Oh my God, somebody might be pregnant here. Then we have the Nine of Cups in reverse. Oh, so this person is thinking that this the relationship might be over. But they, they feel like you're their fulfillment, though. The Nine of Cups, like their, their wish, that everything that they ever wanted, but, you know, of this situation, it might not end up the way that they want to. This is what's going through their heads, but they're taking a chance anyway. Then we have the Four of Pentacles, a, a very selfish energy, somebody that realized that they were very selfish with you, and this is why they feel like this Nine of Cups is prob probably going to be done, though, okay? Wow. You have the Six of Cups in the back of the deck. This person really wants... A second chance with you. They can't stop thinking about you. I feel like they're from your past. For some of you, it might be your childhood. Um, this person wants to come back and connect with you. You know, the seven of swords. A lot of lies in the seat here, okay? A lot of um, discovery here that need to be done. I feel like you don't believe what this person is saying. And you're trying to find out the answers for yourself um, before you can make a decision towards this person. And, you know, communication, you know, in the Queen of Swords. I feel like um, you guys are going to talk about certain things. And here's your strength card. Well, I could go on and on and on with your reading. You know? Um, but we have the Ace of Swords here. So, you know, this person and you are going to have a big talk about your future. Because I don't see you wrapping up this Ten of Pentacles. Okay? <laughs> and this is why I was like, wow. So I don't see you wrapping up this Ten of Pentacles with this person. I feel like you and your, your person is going to talk about this and bring balance back to this relationship in the Six of Pentacles. You know, you guys are going to bring balance back to this relationship. I feel like you guys want to work on this. Okay? Work on this. Then you have the Page of Pentacles. You have the Empress. Wow. Look at that person with that big tummy. For some of you, might be pregnant. Okay? In your femininity. <laughs> femininity. <laughs> okay? But there's going to be some communication towards you. I feel like this person realized that you are all that in a bag of chips. You're stable. I feel like you're a go-getter. Like, you know, you know what you want. And they don't want to lose this, okay? So I feel like they're going to approach you and try to be in your life, okay? Because they don't want anyone else to have you. I feel like right now there's some unsurety here with the sun being in reverse, okay? Like you're not happy with this person right now. I'm going to clarify the sun. Angels, please clarify the sun, please. For Pisces, please clarify the sun. Why is the sun here? Why is the sun here, angels? In reverse, the Pisces. Mm, you want that commitment. This person didn't give you that commitment, and that's why the sun is here. You want a happy ending with this person. You're going to jump back in. You're waiting for this person because right now you are single. That's what it is. Look at all this. You want the Ten of Cups. You want the, you're the fools, and then you want this Two of Wands. Everything that you ever wanted. 
from this person, the world. You see that world right there? You want the world. You want the kids, the house. You want to look. This, this is what you want. You and your person. And until then, you're not going to be happy with this person. This person better give this to you. <laughs> but I feel, I do see that your person is coming back, okay? And this person, I feel like there's going to be a big talk with you and your person with this Ace of Swords here, a big action, a big conversation about this Ten of Pentacles, the legacy that you want with your person and the Six of Pentacles, the balance that's missing in this relationship. Because what we're talking about, balance, here's the Five of Pentacles, why you felt this way, why this relationship ended, you know? Because of the selfishness, this person tends to spend a lot, spend a lot of money if you guys are living together, spend a lot of your money and not putting back in any money in the bank account, or this person for left you for someone else, for some of you, left you in the cold for some of you with this five of, make you feel used, make you feel like you wasn't worth anything in a five of pentacles in the upright, but the five of pentacles in the upright, I don't see you make putting an end to this relationship, like I said. Because we have the Ten of Pentacles here that tells me that you're not putting the end to this relationship, that you still want to be with your person. And then you have the Two of Cups here in the upright. You do. You feel the same way as your person do about you. But anyways, Pisces, I'm going to leave this here. I hope it resonates. If it did, you know what to do. Like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on my channel. And I'll see you guys in your next video. All right, guys? Love you guys. Bye, guys.